Let's go over three multiple choice questions about enzymes. Here's the first question. Which model below represents the molecules at the end of this process? So what we're looking at here is an enzyme that's going to react with this substrate. Now, enzymes typically do one of two things. They either break things down or they join things together. And in this case, it looks like this substrate is going to be broken down by the enzyme. So in our answer, the enzyme shouldn't be changed and the substrate should be broken down. Let's take a look at the answers. A, you can see that both the substrate and enzyme are broken down. This one's wrong. B, the substrate's broken down, but the enzyme's not. This looks like our answer. C, this is what's going to happen when the substrate meets the enzyme at its active site here, but it's going to be broken down after this. So C is not right. D, the substrate's not broken down, but the enzyme is. This is a reverse of what would happen, and it doesn't happen, so D is out. This is why B is the right answer. Here's a second question. The diagram represents enzyme action in a chemical reaction. What are the parts W, X, and Y in this chemical reaction? We know that X here is going to be the enzyme since it's unchanged. So looking at our answers here, it can't be A and it can't be D. So that leaves us with B and C. If you look here, W is going to be the substrate since it reacts with the enzyme to form the products, which is going to be Y. So for this question, C is the right answer. Question three, the diagram above represents a chemical reaction in which a substrate is broken down into two smaller products. So we can see our substrate here and we can see our products here. What type of macromolecule does the X structure belong to? So we're looking at this molecule here. And if we remember, these molecules are known as enzymes. And something really important to remember about enzymes is that all enzymes are proteins, but not all proteins are enzymes. But that means this question's answer is D, since all enzymes are proteins, and we're looking at the structure here, which is an enzyme. 